Well, welcome to you for this evening's game. Regrettably, the weather has been extremely unkind to us here. It is wet and blustery and remarkably inhospitable. Despite all of that, it is good to see that the faithful from both sides have apparently been undeterred. We have a terrific turnout here. The atmosphere is bubbling despite these adverse conditions. All we need now is for the game to live up to its initial billing. One glance and you know where we are. It is one of the most recognisable arenas for the beautiful game in the world. And boy, does it add to the occasion. And so, the national anthems. Bordeaux's got the juices flowing, and now this. to game this between two very high-quality sides. A treat for everybody here. Well, under normal circumstances, this is a massive matchup, and I'm not totally in agreement with the view that friendlies tend to take the edge away. In my experience, if the opposition go at it full tilt, then you have to reciprocate. We'd like to see excitement and be entertained, but if it does go down the serious route, there'll still be lots to enjoy. So we're up and running. Who do you think this turns on, Jim? Yeah, Leonardo Bonucci. He's as imposing as they come, Peter. And he knows just how... Yeah, he's fouled in there. Mertens. Tielemans. Torgan Azar. Torreira Carrasco. Ball's loose, who's getting there? It's Mertens! <laughs> Bonucci is there, and he can get that clear. Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. Italy have made it clear what they're trying to do for me, Peter. What are they trying to do? Well, I think they're making the pitch as big as possible to work both flanks into, into better supply routes. Lorenzo Insigne. Insigne with the crossfield ball. And he's there to hoof it away. And it's Insigne. Have just joined us. Well, you've missed no goals. Defending of the desperate variety. Looking for a decent ball in. Gets good distance on it. Italy have it back and they can go again. Spinazzola. Locatelli. 
And it's played forward. Cleared away. Locatelli. And here's an Immobile! He's pulled off a fine save. Immobile really must have felt he had the measure of the keeper then, but how wrong he was. Berardi plays it short. A nice touch. Surely turns and goes back. And it's Jorginho. And here's Immobile. It's got goes for goal! That has certainly tested the keeper. Well, as test goal, Peter, the keeper has just received an A plus grade. Played it short. Jorginho. And here's Insignia. Lovely bit of skill. Plenty waiting in the middle. Oh, that's neat. Got a size of goal here. He's gone for it! Shoots it out of harm's way. And here's Berardi. Berardi. Cleared without complication. There is the half-time whistle. And both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. Balls at this stage, but certainly not devoid of action. It is 0-0 here at half-time. And we're underway again. Well, the first half didn't really produce the goals we'd have liked. Hopefully they've been saved for the, the second. For that to be the case, though, we'll need to see more energy and invention early on. And here's Insigne. Insigne crosses into the box. Mertens. Tries to get it forward quickly. Breakthrough and well into the second period. It is still anyone's game. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Italy are making a change now. Up to meet it! In it goes! Great corner, and he did the rest. Well, as contact goes, that was tremendous, and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net. I think when it comes to the aerial department, this fella is definitely no slouch. When the manager called on him, he was only too happy to repay that faith. Well, the instruction from the manager would have been, go on and make yourself a nuisance and see if you can snatch a goal. Mission accomplished. Italy get themselves into the lead. Well, we certainly had to wait for it, Peter. Now, a difficult decision. Is it stick or twist? 
for Tongan. Torgan Azar. Tielemans. Your impression so far, Jim? Well, the time has arrived to start taking risks. They may well be happy just to level this. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Belgium are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they can still have a say. Done very well to intervene. The Tongan drives it forward. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Benucci. There's a long ball. Goes to the cross. The keeper has beaten it away. And that's that. Always in the balance. And in the end, one goal was enough. They are narrowly beaten. I've been in this position myself, and this will be difficult to take. They did everything.